So you have a Google Pixel 6a and you have the issue where you have a black screen. Even though you have a black screen, you know that the phone is actually on. Maybe you can feel it vibrate, hear notifications coming in, getting phone calls, and so on. Now another way to tell if your phone is on, if you just have a black screen. Now take note that this one is fixed, but if you go ahead and plug your phone in to the power cable, you should hear it vibrate and hear that, okay? Anyway, this one is fixed, but we're going to pretend I have a black screen here. I'm going to give you guys several steps to get you up and running, and they're all easy steps that you can do right now at your home, okay? So the first thing we want to do is if you have a case on here, go ahead and take the case off, okay? Next thing we want to do is we want to go ahead and restart it, restart the phone using this special key combination here, okay? So let's pretend my screen is black here, and the first thing we want to do is press and hold the power button and the volume up. You want to press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until we see a Google logo appear. So we're going to do this together, okay? Let me take my screen here. It's black, power button, volume up. Ready, set, go. Press and hold. Keep on holding. Pretend my screen is black here. I'm going to continue to hold the volume up and power button until I see a Google logo appear. So I'm still holding here. Still holding. Come on, where's that Google logo at? It's coming. Wait. Wait. Come on. Oh, finally, there it is. Let go of both buttons and hopefully let it boot up normally and hopefully you are out of the black screen. If you're still stuck in the black screen, then we're going to go to step number two. Okay, so you still have a black screen, no problem. So next thing we're going to do is just go ahead and grab your phone and you have the power button here. What I want you to do is press in and out three times, okay? One, two, three, okay? Don't do it five times. If you do it five times and you have the uh, emergency SOS set up, then it's going to call the emergency uh, phone number okay anyway so now I pressed it three times kind of hard just in case if it's like loose or jammed next I'm gonna go ahead and plug in my phone I'm gonna give it power I'm gonna wait five seconds three four five now while it's charged we're gonna restart it using the two key combo again volume up power ready set go press and hold do not let go until we see a Google logo so it's plugged in. I'm still holding on power button and volume up. Just wait until we see a Google logo. So I think the phone just turned off. Now wait for it to turn back on. I'm still holding on both buttons. Power button, volume up. Still holding here. Come on. Where's that Google logo at? There it is. Let go of both buttons and let it boot up normally. And hopefully you are out of the black screen. If you're still in the black screen, then we're going to go to the third step. All right, so for the third step, we can go ahead and unplug our phone. And now while the screen is black, what we're going to do is what I call the tapping method. So what we're going to do is hold the phone like this, and what we're going to do is tap all over the screen and all over the back. And the whole premise behind this is it's possible you have a ribbon that's slightly dislodged or disconnected, and a little tap, believe it or not, can pop it back into place, okay? So we're going to hold the phone like this. We're going to start off on the screen, grab two fingers. What I want you to do is tap, tap like this, kind of hard, all over on the screen. Now, sometimes as you're doing this, your screen might turn on. It might turn off and go black again. You might get half the screen. You might get white lines. But just keep on going. Unless your screen turns on, and then uh, you're probably good to go, okay? So just keep tapping here. Okay, it's a black screen still. No problem. Now, we're going to turn it on the back, and you're going to do the same thing over here. You want to tap kind of hard all over. You really want to get all around the camera lens here. If you don't want to smudge it up, or you can put like a cloth or something on there. And you want to get like even on top of the lens, okay? Tap everywhere, kind of hard. Turn your phone over, tap on the power button, and see if your screen is on. If it's still off from here, then we'll then from here again, we're going to go ahead and restart it using the two key combo. Remember, power button, volume up. Press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until you see the Google logo appear. Then let go of both buttons. And hopefully you're up and running now. If you still have a black screen, then we're going to go to the next possible fix. So you still have a black screen, no problem. What we're going to try next is what I call the massage method. What we're going to do is uh, massage the phone. So we're going to go ahead and hold the phone like this. We're going to grab our two thumbs. And what we're going to do is we're going to press all over on the screen and all over in the back. The same premise with the tapping. You might have a cable that's slightly dislodged. So we'll start off on the screen here. If you don't want to smudge up your screen, you can use a cloth or something. But we're going to hold the phone like this. And what I'm doing is pressing, pressing. Pressing kind of hard, nice, and give it like a good massage all over, okay? 
And sometimes as you're doing this, again, you may get like half a screen. The screen might turn on and turn off. It might flicker. You might get white lines. You might get half a screen. Keep pressing in the same thing on the back. Turn it over and do the same thing all over here. Okay, all in the back. Press kind of hard. Nice massage all over. Even around, all around the lens and everything. On the sides here, on the side, press. Press. Just like that. Look at turn your phone over, pop on that power button, and see if your screen is on. Is on. If it's still off from here, still have a black screen, no problem. Again, restart it using the the key combination: volume up, power. Press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until you see the Google logo appear. Then let go. And hopefully you guys are up and running now. If not, then we're going to go to the next possible fix. Next possible fix I have for you is what I call the smack method. Because what we're going to do is we're going to smack our phone. We're going to hold our palm out like this, and you're going to smack the back and smack the screen. The same premise behind the uh, tapping and massaging. So we're going to go ahead and hold out our palm like this. You can put a cloth on there if you don't want to smudge up your, uh, your screen. What I'm going to do is hold it just like this, and what I'm going to do is smack the screen, the top screen. Look at your phone. You know, again, it may be just perfectly black, or the screen might have turned on. You might get half a screen. You might get white lines. Just keep tapping, and also on the bottom of the screen as well. Okay. Give it a couple taps there. Look at your screen, still black, no problem. Then we're going to do the back side as well, okay? Hold the phone like that. Give it a couple of whacks. Even on the bottom of the back as well, okay? A couple of whacks like that. Turn your phone over. Tap on the power button and see if your screen is on. If not, same thing here. We're going to go ahead and restart it using the two key combination. Power button, volume up. Press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until you see the Google logo appear. And hopefully you are up and running now. If not, then we're going to go to the next possible fix. So the next possible fix I have for you is what I call the freezer method. What I want you to do is grab your phone just like this, just bare bone naked, no case or nothing on there. Go to your freezer. Put this in your freezer, nice cold freezer, and leave it there for about 15 to 20 minutes. After 15 to 20 minutes, grab your nice cold phone out of the freezer, tap on that power button, and see if this screen is on. If it's still black, you still have a black screen, then from here, while, while your, fo your phone is nice and cold, restart it using the two key combination method. Volume up, power button, press and hold. Do not let go until you see a Google logo appear, then let go. Now, the thing is, if you guys tried all of these steps and your screen is still not on, then what I would recommend is start from the very step one again, step two, step three. Try all the steps. It doesn't work a second time. Try it three times, four times. Try it at least up to seven times. Sometimes the seventh time is a charm. Okay? Anyway, if this worked for you, please comment uh, which method you think worked for you. And if it didn't, give me a thumbs down. If you guys follow all of these methods, at least minimum 50% of you guys should be back up and running. Okay? Good luck, guys.